ServiceNow Vulnerability Response helps you view and respond to all vulnerabilities across all IT assets from a single pane of glass. Now you can view application vulnerabilities from DAST, SAST, SCA, and penetration testing findings from tools like Veracode, Sneak, Fortify, and Checkmarks. Vulnerability Manager Carla Jackson logs into her ServiceNow instance to the Vulnerability Manager workspace. This unified workspace brings together all of Carla's working concerns for her organization's vulnerabilities into one space. Infrastructure, containers, application, and configuration compliance. It's all here in one location. Here, we see an overview of application vulnerabilities over time, vulnerable items in remediation efforts, and any active remediation efforts if applicable. In the Vulnerable Items tab, we can see all of the related application vulnerable items. We can also see application vulnerabilities from dynamic application security test findings. For example, the application Zero Online Banking has had a recent increase in critical vulnerabilities. Let's look at the imported data from the Application Vulnerability Scanner. Note that ServiceNow displays important contextual data from the scanner like location and findings details. ServiceNow also performs automated calculations to determine risk score, risk rating, assignment group, and remediation target based on configurable rules. These calculations can take full advantage of other ServiceNow data like CMDB and business services information. The scan application can be mapped to its related services in the CMDB, providing information about the service context to be used by ServiceNow calculators and rules. For instance, here we can see that the Zero Online Banking scan application is used by the Rewards Processing Service. After seeing the data that we have imported from the scanner, let's talk about how we can configure various rules to prioritize and assign the work that needs to be performed. This is where we will use the same common features as vulnerability response to make work happen. Assignment rules allow you to automate assignment based on data from the scanner findings and business contexts in ServiceNow. These rules will set the assignment on the application vulnerable items data type when it's imported from the scanner. In our case, the vulnerabilities for the zero online banking application are automatically assigned to the support group from the scanned application CI, Team Angels. Next, remediation target rules allow you to automatically determine when findings are due. These rules can be configured to populate remediation target dates according to your internal policies and allow you to notify stakeholders as the remediation target approaches. In our case, the application vulnerable item has been given the shortest remediation timeframe of 15 days because the risk rating was 1, critical. If internal policy changes, the remediation target can be reduced and automatically recalculated for all applicable vulnerable items. Vulnerability calculators are a powerful way to prioritize your findings based on risk, considering multiple sources of data. These rules can be used to automatically calculate the risk score for an application vulnerable item, and you can configure them to use information from the scanner findings, third-party sources like OWASP, and business context from ServiceNow like service criticality. Additional criteria can be added as well. These calculations can be used to prioritize when the work is performed. Normalized severity maps allow ServiceNow to rationalize prioritization across many tools into a single consolidated view. These are used to normalize the severity field on the vulnerability when it's imported. This is important when importing vulnerabilities from different sources like Sneak and Veracode so that we can normalize their severity values with ours. For example, this allows ServiceNow to normalize the Veracode provided severity value of 5 for Veracode 18 CWE 78 to the common ServiceNow value 1 critical. Finally, it's easy to bring data into ServiceNow application vulnerability response from your tool of choice. Take for example the integration configuration, where the Veracode vulnerability integration is set up. In this module, you can populate your API ID and API key to set up the integration quickly and easily. You can select which finding types and severities to include, as well as whether exceptions and false positives should be handled in ServiceNow and updated back to Veracode. We offer out-of-box, easy-to-configure integrations with many tools like Sneak, 
check marks, and Fortify On Demand, allowing customers to get a full picture of SAST, DAST, SCA, and penetration test findings from any toolset. ServiceNow continues to enhance and develop new integrations with technology partners. Our integrations can also be used as a gold standard design for customers and implementation partners to develop their own integrations with their tool of choice. Application Vulnerability Response provides a single place to track all of your application vulnerabilities, including those from your own Software Bill of Materials or SBOM repository. Simply upload your application's SBOM to ServiceNow and automated rules will generate application vulnerable items for vulnerable components. ServiceNow acts as a hub for your application and SBOM information, allowing you to explore dependencies and track findings from your SBOMs alongside findings from scanner tools like Sneak SCA. Now that we've shown how application vulnerability response works, you can see how ServiceNow can act as the single platform for application security by unifying data from all your scanning tools into a single pane of glass you can gain visibility into your application security posture from every attack surface and drive remediation workflows with real business context, making reporting easier and making workflows more efficient. Thanks for watching.